I went from living in a backyard full of weeds and roaches and all sorts of crap to a yard with artificial turf and a backyard resort. And I'm gonna show you that today. My backyard didn't always look like this. It was four years ago we bought this property and for years my wife and I struggled on what we would do with the backyard. Before, it had a shed, it had weeds that just would not die no matter what we did to our backyard. Weeds were everywhere, bugs, and in Florida there's not a whole lot of soil. There's just a lot of sand, so dust was everywhere in our house. And it wasn't until late last year we finally said, it's time to put in some artificial turf. We looked around, we went all over the place kind of interviewing different companies, and we finally chose Home Depot to support and sponsor with a company they use, Sinlon, to come here and install artificial turf. It was the best investment we've ever done for our property. We love it. We now can entertain people on the turf. We have no bugs. We have no issues. Water runs off. This is one of the best decisions we've made to enhance not only the value of our property, but to enjoy our lifestyle here in Florida. So today in this video, I'm gonna show you some of the costs, the decision-making we went through, the different choices and types of artificial grass we had to choose from. I'll show you how the whole process laid out, some before and after pictures. I'm gonna give you the whole gamut of what it takes to put artificial turf into your property, whether it's a front yard or backyard. But if this is your first time on my channel, please do me a favor, smack that bell, hit the subscribe button so you're notified every time a new video drops. I am John Whelan with EXP Realty here in Delray Beach. And if you have any questions, call me at the phone number below, send me a text, send me an email. I'd love to help you on your journey here in South Florida. To give you some context, this is how bad our backyard looked after we bought the property. You can see we had a shed that was just full of crazy stuff. It was wood, it was old, tons of cockroaches, tons of ants, it was just a mess. And then you can see we started to tear it down. We got rid of the walls and finally had some guy come in and tear it down so you can see the concrete slab. And then we started to lay out our backyard a little bit. Now on this particular photo, you can see now we've got dirt. We cleaned out the area and behind our neighbor put in a fence with us and some grass. And then finally, we started to lay out some pavers just to kind of get some ideas what this whole thing could turn into. Once our vision came clear, then we decided, okay, after we bought this hedge, which is a native Floridian plant called the Jamaican caper up against the fence, then we realized we needed a border. We needed to hold in the, the dirt that was a lot of overfill from when they dug our pool. So you can see I hired a couple guys to get these railroad ties in there. We created a barrier between the back pool area and the front patio area. These things weigh about 160 pounds each. So you can see we got two guys carrying each railroad tie. And they then put in the barrier on the left side of the property up against the fence that would then hold in the dirt between the pool and the fencing area. Now that the area is prepared, the guys come in, the installation crew comes in, and they first put in a base of about two to four inches. In my case, it was about three inches of crushed rock and sand. And you can see how they pound it here in this video. So after the ground is compact, then they come in and they put the heavy tarp. They do a double layer heavy tarp on that, which holds everything in. Now we have a two degree pitch going from the pool out away to the shrubs. And then they come in, they start laying the grass. So a little bit about the grass process. You know, we went through Home Depot after looking at this process because we were just one of the big brand to back us for warranty. This specific company, Sin Lawn, through Home Depot, it's a 22-year warranty. We opted out of the three different types of grasses. There was a low, medium, and high grade. We got the high grade, which was called Lozano. It has a beautiful undertone brown color so that it looks real as you're walking through it. The total price for this installation, which was a two-day installation, was $7,600. You can see in this area is about 450 square feet. The other area is about the same. So for about 1,200 square feet, $7,600 was our total. After all the stretching and pulling and getting the grass to form the area that we've made, they've already laid down a concrete barrier around all sides. Then they glue it 
and as you can see they stretch and pull and everything is taut and nice and tight and now the next video you're going to see a machine that really takes silica sand which is used as an infill for artificial turf to help the turf grass blades the actual grass stand upright and to help provide some uv protection for the backing of the material the backing material is a very thick black material it gives the artificial grass a natural feel under the feet when you're walking on it so it provides additional cushing it kind of makes it feel similar as if you're walking on natural grass which it does now we start the second day of the process which is near the house where they had to do another 2% grade for water flow away from the house to the property line. We added pavers that we originally had from a prior patio. We did a 4 inch by 4 inch separation that would act as our, our walking path toward the pool. So once they get the pavers lined up they spent a lot of time, this was the thing that impressed me most about this crew with Sinlon, was they spent a lot of time making sure the leveling north, south, east to west of each paver was perfect. They made sure that the four inch gap on all sides was perfect for the walkway. And once they're done, then they basically put a concrete border around it so that the pavers don't shift on the ground. You can ultimately, if one cracks or breaks, you can lift it out and put it back in place, but the shifting will be there for the lifetime of the patio. Now comes a lot of the meticulous work. As you can see here, this is the gluing. When they take the four inch strip in the middle of the walking path, they lay down this green glue adhesive, meticulously lay it down, step on it, make sure everything's in place. And these guys were on their hands and knees. And you see some of these photos in the video. These guys were on their hands and knees, laying down, carving out, cutting with scissors, making sure that all the edges were done perfectly so that everything was put into the glue and the formation perfectly their attention to detail was impeccable and once it's done adding a little bit of water then they come in with another roller of silica they go through the whole process dropping a bunch of bags of silica they come back in with the other big machine that really grinds the silica into the base of the artificial turf the bottom side that allows for durability protection from uv rays make sure that the strands are standing straight and really gives it that nice feel under your feet when you're walking on it so that you feel like you're walking on real grass. Now it's done, a little air blower to get rid of the extra dirt and, and chips and rocks that have been left behind from two days of work and construction. We now have our finished patio, side yard patio, with about 1,200 square feet of artificial turf. Pavers installed for $7,600, 22-year warranty. I will no longer have to water this area, which will save me some, some money on utilities and my water bill. And it will have this long-lasting life, beautiful green color for years and years to come. Job well done. Well, that was my personal behind the scenes look at my personal house here in Delray Beach. It's been three weeks. My wife, daughter, and I, and our dog absolutely love the artificial grass that we put in. It's gonna be looking like this for the next 20 years. It's clean, it's perfect, it's gonna be green. No hassle, no leaves, no cockroaches, no bugs. It's gorgeous. We feel like we live in a resort. If you like that information, beside me over here is my deck. We just put a pool in. I'm going to give you a complete behind the scenes view of how we installed our pool this year with all the costs and all the goodies in a video in a few weeks. Until then, please give me a phone call, send me a text, get a hold of me somehow, and some, hit that subscribe button so you're notified next time a new video drops. And we will see you next time. Fantastic job. Gracias, caballeros. Pura vida, pura vida. Muchísimas gracias, amigo.